Hi, I'm Sam and this is Sam Says. Today I'm going to be doing an insert review for the Go7 Gaming insert for Marvel Champions. Go ahead and check out the next clip to see how it all fits in the box. Welcome back. Now that you know how it fits in the box, let's go ahead and talk about it. Honestly, there's not a lot to say about this insert because there's not a lot to it. But just because there's not a lot to it does not mean that it's not worth it or that there's not uh, good things going on. So it is a very simple insert because basically all that Marvel Champions is is cards. You have a couple of tokens and you have a couple of counters. And that's it. Really, that's all that goes in the box. So the insert itself doesn't need to be complex. In fact, the simplicity makes it very elegant and makes it work well. Uh, it fits your cards really well. It fits all of the tokens. Uh, the nice thing about this is all these tokens, it makes it easy for gameplay. So when I'm actually setting up the game to play, I just set out these two token trays and then as I need things, I can actually pull them out. So it helps for in-game play as well. Anytime that I have an insert works for in-game play, you'll know if you watch any of my videos. Love it! So, love these trays. They work really well. They have those lids on them, so you can put them away right in that center slot. Uh, also, you'll notice that there were a ton of these. These are the dividers, and you get a lot. These are just the extra dividers. So I haven't gone through in this insert yet and done uh, a ton of extra organization, like characters out and then the different like faction abilities. I can't remember what they're called uh, in Marvel Champions. Um, but I haven't separated all of those out, but you can. And there appears to be plenty of room for expansions. So if you'll notice in this box, I only have the base game. So I don't have any of the scenario packs. I don't have any of the character packs and the villain packs, anything like that. But there is tons of room to be able to fit plenty of those um and you'll notice these things on the side right here so you can actually add in those smaller cards that's where i showed you it had like those condition cards um and these i had kind of in the bottom of the box uh these you can put in each side of or each one of these big trays has two uh, or one spot on each side so you could separate however many of those that you want depending my guess is on how many conditions are released later on where i haven't played anything past the base game i don't know if there are more or not um, but i'm sure there will be more conditions uh, later on so you have options uh, so i did not glue mine in because you just never know uh this insert's really simple but it's very effective it stores things, it gives you the options for how you want to customize your game. Building it, okay, this is the sheet for building it. This tells you about it. This is their construction tips that they give you at the front of really every single one of their inserts at Go7 Gaming. And this is your instructional page. That's it. Very easy to build. Very, very easy. It does not take a lot of time. And you might ask, is it better than this? Yes. Take this. That was very loud, and I'm sorry. It was for dramatic effect. Uh, I don't like that insert. Um, I thought where Fantasy Flight gave a custom insert, it was going to be something cool, but then, like, it looked like they had spots for dividers, but then there weren't dividers included, and the cards didn't actually fit very well. I ended up using these things as dividers, which didn't work well. Didn't love that insert. This insert, fantastic. Um, I don't know how many expansions you're going to be able to fit into it uh, before it gets really filled up, um, but I sleeve my cards, so a lot of space for my games is taken up by sleeving. If you don't sleeve your cards, you will probably be able to, with this insert, sleeve 
expansions for the foreseeable future and beyond. If you sleeve, maybe. I don't know how many expansions you're going to be able to fit without actually trying it. Uh, Fantasy Flight, if you want to send me expansions and see how, uh, how many it fits, you know, I'm open to that. <laughs> but uh, anyway, it works really well. Very simple, very easy. I'm going to link to Go7 Gaming's uh, website in the description section. So if you like this insert and you want to pick it up, you can head down there to Go7 Gaming. Very sturdy insert, very easy to build, very easy to understand, intuitive, and functionality is great. So I'm Sam, this was Sam Says. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you have a great rest of your day. Please hit the like button, the subscribe button if you haven't already, uh, and leave me a comment, let me know what you thought. Thanks for watching, have a great day and game on.